Hello and welcome to this week's Angel Oracle card reading for week commencing the 8th of July 2024. My name is Ray and I'm a guide who helps you remember your divine presence so that you can heal your past, transform your present, create your future so that you can step onto your spiritual path, spread your wings and soar, raise your consciousness, come out of that spiritual closet to actually fully embody who you are supposed to be in this lifetime. Now, this week we're going to be using the Archangel Oracle cards by um, Doreen Virtue. Had to forget, no forgot her name then. Um, but as always, before we get into this week's reading, I would like to say thank you so, so much for your continued support. It really does mean a lot to me to be able to be of service to you and for you to trust me enough to use my services. So thank you so, so much. And of course, with that in mind and my services, this coming Saturday, the 13th of July, I'm going to be at the Little Horse Yard in Horton Kirby at the wellness event there. Um, I'm going to be in the caravan. I'm going to be offering um, Angelic Craigie session with a card reading um, for a very discounted um, price. So if you're around at the weekend and you want to do a come to a wellness event, there's lots of other stuff going on as well and um, some workshops, then please do uh, check out the link or check out um, my website, uh, events page or Facebook. Um, it'll be lovely to see you. And if you did want to book in an Angelic Craigie session with me, um, then please do uh, let me know in advance and I can book you in advance just in case there's no spaces available on the day. And of course, I'm going to be starting Angelic Craigie 1 and 2 training on the 17th and 18th of August. So if you want to um, learn about angels, do um, learn a healing modality that you can use on yourself, family, friends, um, learn more about yourself, spiritual gifts, etc. then it's a brilliant workshop to do. So do check that out. Anyway, as always, I'll give the cards a quick lens and a bless. So what does everyone who's watching this need to know for their highest good for week commencing the 8th of July, 2024? What does everyone, okay, who's watching this need to know for their highest good? Okay, so we've got three cards that are, um, literally have spoken today. So we have got Teaching and Learning, Archangel Zadkiel. Keep an open mind and learn new ideas, then teach these ideas to others. Remember who you are, Archangel Michael. You are a powerful, loving and creative child of God. You are very loved. And prosperity, Archangel Ariel, your material needs are provided as you follow your intuition and manifest your dreams into reality. So absolutely brilliant cards um, this week. Um, so what they're saying to, to me this week is that you need to be open to all the possibilities, the ideas that are coming through at this moment in time. Don't just dismiss anything because it seems a little bit too far out there or it doesn't resonate with you. Go into it a little bit deeper um, because you may find there are nuggets of truth in there that can actually help you um, evolve and to actually bring forward things into your life so that you can actually move, move forward. And of course, do look at you know, learning new things, whether that's things like angelic reiki um, or um, cooking or fishing or, you know, anything like that. If there are opportunities for you to learn something new, then this is a week to actually um, do that, to do that because the energy is there. And of course, the thing is, once you actually start learning this stuff, you're then able to pass it on to others to help them on, on their journey, on their path. And that's the, that's the beauty and the amazing thing about when you learn something new. And by doing this, you're actually going to remember who you truly are, why you are here, you know, come to, coming to peace with, with yourself and who you are and why, and why you are here. Um, you know, you are a loving being. You are here to bring joy and light to the world, even if it doesn't feel like it sometimes. Every single one of us has a purpose, has a role here on, on earth. 
and it's it really is remembering what that role is but know that you are loved no matter what you do or how you do it you know the universe god source whatever you want to call it has always got your back even if you don't think so um they have always they have always got they, your back and like the angels they love you unconditionally there is no condition on it and they accept you for who you are but the question is do you accept who you who you are and that's going to be your your learning this week who are you truly it's time to remember who you who you truly are and why and why you are here and know that when you are do actually remember and know why you're here you are learning you are teaching you are expanding you are exploring you are being curious that all your material needs are all met you know that you can manifest anything into your life and that the um the money will be there for you to do um whatever it is you need to learn if it's something that that costs you know the money is there because when you you step onto that path and you start doing those things the universe goes great you're actually listening to us you're remembering who you are you're actually um, learning this this thing whatever whatever it is so that you can go and teach we're going to give you the 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 money um the time uh you know to actually do this so know that once when you do step on, onto that path and you are, and you are this week remembering who you are and looking about what you can learn and teach. And it could be that you've learned stuff that you're not teaching. You have all this information, this knowledge, but you're not out there sharing it. You know, this is a week to share that information, that knowledge as well. And again, that will help you manifest um, and bring things into your life that will help you move forward and, you know, and actually bring your dreams into reality. So know that, that all that is possible this week. So really, that's kind of like the message I'm getting. As always, I draw these cards for what you need to know for your highest good. So you could look at these cards and get a completely different interpretation. And that's absolutely fine. Um, so the cards that we had out are Teaching and Learning, Archangel Zadkiel. Keep an open mind and learn new ideas. Then teach these ideas to others. Be open to all possibilities this week because you never know where they might end up taking you. Remember who you are, Archangel Michael. You are a powerful, loving and creative child of God. You are very loved. When you remember who you are, you have the power to create anything in your life that is for your highest good and the highest good of others. And prosperity, Archangel Ariel, your material needs are provided as you follow your intuition and manifest your dreams into reality. When you start walking your talk, talking your, yeah, I think it's walking your talk or talking your walk, or whatever that saying is, when you actually start, when you remember who you are and you are doing what you're supposed to be doing, prosperity just throws itself at you completely. So please do let me know in the comments or message me privately as to whether these cards resonated with you, whether you got your own interpretation. As I always love to hear, um, you know, what these cards meant for you. And I always reply to anyone who messages me privately or publicly. Um, and don't forget to check out all that I have to offer, uh, especially the workshop, uh, the, sorry, the workshop, the wellbeing event this weekend. Um, and obviously the Angelic Craigie workshops um future life progression training which is going to be taking place in october um and anything else um out out there that can help you on your journey and of course uh, you know you can always contact me and arrange a free 20 to 30 minute video call to discuss where you are now where you want to go and um, how to get there and we'll see whether i can i can give you some guidance um on on that and don't forget to check out my show, Angels and Destiny, which if you're watching this on Sunday the 7th, is taking place on Monday the 8th at 8 p.m. UK time. And if you're watching later in the week, then please do watch the replay. I've got the beautiful Sedona Swan as my guest, and I'm really looking forward to that conversation with her. So have a wonderful week. Um, remember who you are and allow that prosperity to come in. And I will speak to you next week. Take care. Bye.